Hi guys, welcome back to another edition of PV Crazy for Food Kitchen. So it's Friday night and I am preparing today Nashville hot chicken. Um, so let's start. This time it's gonna be Nashville hot chicken. Okay, so the chicken is already, I've cleaned it. Um, big pieces of chicken were there. So I've uh, cut them into half. Okay, so the chicken is done. Okay, so this I took two eggs. So I'm gonna put a lot of red chilies into it. And then I'm gonna throw in a lot of red chili powder. This is the hot Indian style chili powder. Put a little bit of milk. I know I have seen recipes using buttermilk not going with that and definitely my favorite spice um, sauce that I have this one is from Caribbean uh, one drop this is uh, pepper sauce but this one man this is so good better than sriracha means if you're into spicy stuff this you must try and this one you cannot get in Toronto that's what I heard this is only available in Caribbeans. So gonna put that for more spiciness because we are making Nashville hot chicken. It has to be hot and it should, it not should, it must burn your mouth. Mix it nicely. Okay, so let's move on. This is all purpose flour. I'm gonna put some spices in this also and season the flour. Again, uh, putting red chili powder in this. I would say go crazy on that. And then chili flakes, salt as per your taste. I am definitely throwing um, this masala called MDH um, Kitchen King. Um, this will give a good flavor. Okay, so what you have to do is basically mix it. I put some more chilies into this. Okay. I am using um, these breadcrumbs. And this one is again the spicy one. Hot and spicy. So everything on this table today is all about spiciness. Okay, so as I showed you, the egg uh, mixture is ready, breadcrumbs are ready, our flour is ready, and here is our chicken. So let's start preparing. Okay guys, so let's go ahead and take this piece, put it in the all-purpose seasoned flour, then we put it in egg mixture and then goes back again into the seasoned flour cover it nicely one more time in the egg batter and then in the breadcrumbs the spicy breadcrumbs and then into the fryer as this one is cooking on one side and you can cook like with these big pieces i'm gonna cook one piece at a time so you know cooking is done properly but this one i cooked and uh, this is one time cooking um, there's gonna be a second time cooking at a high heat temperature which is gonna give the crispiness you can hear the sound of chicken being cooked in cooking oil. Okay, so this is my first batch of um, all the fried chicken. Now I'm gonna cook this on high heat to make it more crispier from outside. See this man, it's looking yummy and crispy 
crispy but it's gonna get more crispy okay guys now look at this now you see it's more crispy you hear that yeah that's the crispiness I was looking for so this crispiness came after I double cooked so this is still hot and uh, over here I had the hot oil which I'm gonna use in the seasoning meantime uh, for the burgers um, took out the mayo some red chilies into this and um, chili flakes mix it no brown sugar no I don't use brown sugar it makes the food um, milder and it makes the food more sweeter which I don't like okay now I come to the last part where we're gonna put all the chili powder I'm gonna definitely put this kitchen king and uh, I'm just putting um, red chilies some kitchen king and then I'm using the same oil hot oil And you mix that into it and now you put this whole big ass chicken piece in this and just turn it Ooh. make sure you bathe the chicken in this over here what I'm gonna do is put mayo on both the buns and as my chicken is ready Nashville you put it here and that is your Nashville chicken awesome Nashville chicken okay so let's go ahead cut it out taste it so let's cut it guys and that's how it looks okay so taste test time cheers Nashville chicken mmm it is spicy but still not my level spicy but yeah it is spicy enough um, I don't like any salad or um, you know coleslaw um, so there is no sugar I've added in this it's all chilies red chilies and um, the other chili paste it's really good so good delicious but you should cook if you want your chicken to be very crispy you must cook it two times so here we go guys again this is the Nashville chicken and my kids rated this 6 1 rated 7 out of 10 that's what the rating is go with my kids rating Mmm, super good, super duper good. So that was the video about Nashville chicken guys. Thanks for joining PV Crazy for food. See you in next food vlog. Take care. Bye.